Greetings YouTube, this is Venomous Woe here, and I am battling against Prankstar73, aka Breloom Breeks. We're changing the ceremonial good luck. Now, Prankstar73 is a fellow clan member of mine in a clan called the Battling Academy. We are both senior members there. He's a first year senior. No, I'm a first year senior. He's a third year senior. So, yeah, and we're going to have an epic bout here. We, he started off with Weavile. I lead it off with Durant. He switched out of Weavile into Jirachi. I use X Scissor. Almost takes out Jirachi. Not quite, but almost. So, I decided to try an X Scissor again. Yeah, he says down there that he forgot Durant was so fast he hits like 354 speed. Okay, so X Scissor takes out Girachi. Then he sends in Chandelure. And at this point, Durant is pretty much stopped cold. Thunderfang is not going to kill Chandelure in one shot. No matter how high his attack is. So I decided to send in Tentacruel to take the Heat Wave. Tentacruel gets burnt. And I'm like, Fudge! Really? Well, it's not that big a deal, I guess. Burns are really bad if your Pokemon's physically oriented, not specially oriented like Tentacruel. So he switches out into Latias. I decided to try an Ice Beam Latias. This thing is bulky as crap or something because it takes Ice Beams like a boss. So Tentacruel is pretty much useless at this point, so I decided to just get whatever damage I can and let Latias or the Burn kill it off. It dies to Life Orb. Lands a critical hit though, which is nice. So I decided to send out Gliscor. Try to Swords Dance to boost my attack. And I try, try to go for Ice Fang. And once again, Latias proves just how bulky it is. It just shrugs that off like nobody's business. Psychic from Latias takes out Gliscor. I decide to send in Volcarona. There's Stealth Rocks on the field, unfortunately, I, so Volcarona loses half its health, and Tentacruel can't rapid spin them away because it's dead. So he sends in Alakazam, Bug Buzz takes Alakazam out in a single shot. So now Chandelure is back on the field. I tried to use Bug Buzz, doesn't quite work out, Chandelure is faster. He told me after the battle that it was Choice Scarf, so, so that's why it was faster than Volcarona. I tried to use Pursuit, he sends it back, which does quite a bit of damage as a result. So he sends him a champ, I think about switching out, but then he's like, but I was like, no. Because anything that I send out is going to hit, get hit by Dynamic Punch and end up confused. So I just decided to stay in, hit him with Return, and just hope for the best. Does a fair amount of damage, but not enough to take it out. He uses Ice Punch for some reason. I guess he was expecting I would. I guess he was expecting that I wouldn't stay in. So Amapalm takes out the Champ. A Nice Shard from Weavile takes out Amapalm. Now Durant is back on the field. I try to use Iron Head, hoping for super effective damage. Ice Punch does not do that much. Iron Head knocks him down to his Sash. And Weavile is out. Now Chandelure is back on the field again. I try to use Thunderfang, hoping to take it out, but once again, it's Scarfed Prowess. Um, takes out Durant. I 
I try to use Hidden Power on Chandelure. <clears throat> Latias comes back in, does not do enough. So I try to use Calm Mind just to get my power up. Latias is just incredibly bulky here. I am amazed at how strong the, its defenses are. Alright, so I try to do Hidden Power again, doesn't quite work out, well it takes it out, yeah it works out quite a bit. And so now here's the final stretch of the match, one Pokemon each, Chandelure takes out Verizion with a Heat Wave, so good job Prankstar, that was one hell of a match, probably one of the best matches I've ever had. See you guys next time.